Happy Sunday. Happy Sunday. We are starting the Sunday right. We're going to get donuts. I'm very excited about it. I woke up absolutely craving donuts and then I was like, you know what? No, I'm just gonna make a bacon, egg, and cheese. Um, I was gonna make a bacon, egg, and cheese, but then I was like, you know what? I don't want something savory. I just want donuts. So we're going to get donuts and can we stop at Starbucks too? Uh -huh. We're gonna go to Starbucks too. And then um, it's noon. The Eagles play at one. So I'm gonna go to my parents later during the game. They're having people over and I'm gonna go hang out with my parents, watch the game. I was editing the vlog yesterday or this morning when I woke up, I was editing it from yesterday. The way that like we talk to each other is People probably think we hate each other. Why? Because we just kind of sound like we bicker, but we don't actually bicker. But that would answer you, I'm like, mm-hmm. I think they hate I us. I was like, oh, what do you want to do? Like, you want to go to like Bluebird? You want to do this? You want to get out of the car? You want to do that? And you were just like, yeah, <laughs> sure. <laughs> tell you one thing, I don't want to put up Christmas lights. <laughs> I'll rush today. Okay. Four hours and 36 minutes. Until the sun goes down. Hey, beats yesterday. Yesterday you had 30 minutes of daylight. What are you gonna get? I'm gonna get cinnamon sugar, french toast, and cinnamon bun. Good for you. Donut wall, okay. I got chocolate with sprinkles. Um, I think this is maple. This one, wait, this is peanut butter. This is vanilla, this one's mine with like powdered sugar and then these were, one was like French toast, one was like maple, one was like a cinnamon bun, I don't know. But anyway, this is our donut haul and I'm gonna make cheesy eggs and bacon and some toast with it too. car um all right it's 2 30 we got such a late start to the day i didn't wake up like so so late i woke up like what time did i wake up like nine and then i just edited the vlog no i woke up later than nine maybe like 9 30 i don't know late start to the day it's a lazy sunday sue me um anyway I'm heading to my parents now to um, watch the Eagles game a little bit. The game started at 1, so I think it's like halftime. I honestly don't know. I've been watching TikToks since the game started, so I really don't know what time it is. But I think my mom made pasta, which I'm excited about. I ate two donuts this morning. It was glorious, and I made those eggs and the bacon, and oh my god, it was so, like such a good breakfast this morning. That's like what every Sunday, this is how every Sunday should feel. This is just like amazing. But yeah, I don't really have any plans today. I feel like this is going to be probably one of my shorter vlogs that I've posted since Vlogmas has started. I'm going to turn off my thing because it's so loud. Since Vlogmas has started, um, I just don't really have tons to do today. It's a lazy Sunday. I'm loving every second of it. Um, and then tonight, I Sunday nights, I always just plan in my planner, which I'll show you guys. And I... Um, and like my groceries and stuff so that's always just my Sundays so I think next weekend I have a couple more things to do like this weekend I had nothing on the calendar which is so nice next weekend we don't have anything to do the weekend after that is my, my boyfriend's anniversary so as of now the only thing I have planned is a dinner reservation out in Philly but I just have that as like a placeholder where it's like if we don't think of anything else like we'll go do that but if we'd rather do something else then we will do something else but we don't know what yet. Um, and then the weekend after that is Christmas so and then the weekend after that is New Year's. And I think I'm gonna go down to the beach for New Year's but I've been loving Vlogmas so far. I'm having a lot of fun vlogging. I'm having a lot of fun editing and looking back at these 
videos it's also nice like knowing that i just don't have to like talk every single second of every clip like i can just do voiceovers and just like film my day and people are just like interested in just the actual day-to-day -day rather than feeling entertained because the actual day-to-day -day is entertaining for other people well to me it just feels boring because it's my life but anyway yeah i'll show you guys when i get to my parents i'm also still in my pajamas i have not changed i also think that there's like people at my parents like i think they are having people over so whatever oh also my grandma comes into town later this vlogmas what week is this i think she comes to town not this week but next week like the middle of next week so <sighs> what gravel will be in the vlog soon i wanted to go to a tree farm this weekend but we didn't really have time and we kept sleeping in late we're just both just so tired oh i downloaded flow this morning to track my cycle because on vlogmas day one i talked a lot about my period and if i wanted to be on birth control or off birth control yada 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 you guys had a lot of great tips in the comments the overall thing was like everyone was like talk to your doctor and the frustrating thing is i have talked to my doctor multiple multiple times so i think i just need to maybe get a new gynecologist but every time i would talk to her about my birth control and not liking it or wanting to be off of it she would just re she's really pro birth control so she is really like pushing me to be on something rather than talk about cycle tracking or any other like any other forms of being off birth control entirely it's just not an option with her like she's always like if I say like I want to be off birth control she's like well do you want to get pregnant and I say no and she goes well then you need to be on it and then she's like, so I recommend if you don't want hormones to do, I don't know why I emphasized hormones like that. If you don't want hormones, then do a Kylina IUD, but I don't want an IUD for reasons that I just don't, I just don't want an IUD. Um, and I don't like the pill I'm on. So yesterday was my last day taking the pill on this pack. So I just don't think I'm just gonna do it again. And I got flow, so I'm gonna start really tracking. And you guys left really good tips when dealing with bad period cramps. So I'm just gonna try it out because, and I was also talking to Lindsay about it, like having one day of bad period cramps is worth feeling sane the remaining days of my cycle, but feeling like a little out of my body and not like myself for 28 days on birth control is just like not worth it. Like I'd rather have like one day of uncomfort, but then all the other days are good and normal and I feel like myself rather than 28 days of not feeling like myself just so I can have a not period, a not painful period. I explained that so horribly, but I think you guys know what I mean. All right, um, I'm about to go down a hill and my camera's gonna fly, so I gotta go. Pretty tree mom. Literally as soon as I get here. Come on, we're going for a walk. So now we're walking. Now we're walking. Mr. Ringo. Where'd you go for dinner last night? Um, harvest. Oh, yeah. did you? Yes. What time? 6.45. Oh my God, we went at 4.30. <laughs> no freaking way. That is funny. Wait, tell everyone what is for dinner though. Um. I found this recipe on TikTok. Oh my God, TikTok is where I'm getting all my recipes I right know, now. me too. Um, it's a Tuscan white ragu. So it's leeks, carrots, sausage, orange juice, mm. and white wine. Mm. So taste it, tell me what you think. Mm. Interesting, right? Yeah, that's good. Homemade bread, this is still rising. Oh, is that your recipe that you put in the oven? I will. So wait, when did you make this? Today. What what time though? 11, 12, noon, I guess. And you just have it hot in your pan? Yeah, just leave it simmer for a couple hours. And you don't burn it? No. Turn it all the way down. Interesting. I should do that. Let the flavors develop. So you learn so much from your mom cooking. Oh my God, our sea salt flakes. <laughs> yeah, I did them too. Did you make more of them? No, I did these. 
with the Disney shop, like, of course. Wait, so my mom and I, when we were shopping for Thanksgiving stuff, we were like looking everywhere for sea salt flakes. We couldn't find it. We had to go to a bougie grocery store and we finally found the sea salt flakes. And then a couple days later, I came over for dinner and my mom made these like really good chocolate peanut butter, like rice crispy little balls. And they were so good, but they were especially good because we put the sea salt flakes on it. And, and then we I put them on everything. And now we put them on literally everything, but... It was my dad that was in charge of the sea salt flakes, so he had to put three flakes on each ball. <laughs> did he do these? No, I did those. This is the best recipe. It's saltine crackers, brown sugar, and chocolate. Right? And butter. And butter. I think everyone knows how to make these, though. Mm -hmm. Cookie crack. And the eagles are winning. Oh, yeah, I didn't even remember that they were winning. This is our pasta that we're going to have tonight. Yum. See, this is where I get it from. <laughs> like, no, let's just stay up here and hibernate, the two of us. <laughs> Wait, did you watch my vlog the other day when I was like, I have to run errands, but I was talking to my mom and she said she was gonna stay home. Because <laughs> it's raining. I'm not going out. So I stayed home because it was raining. <laughs> oh man. The um pandemic has definitely done me in. On that, yeah, me too. Well, I just the, have no. Mm -mm. I know. Me too. I have to really need to go somewhere. To go well, somewhere. the other night, I went to go pick up Italian food, and everyone was sitting inside eating. I'm like, I would not like sit in here to eat. Like, mm -hmm. I would just go get takeout. Right. And same with like Honey Girl. Like, we went to Honey Girl, and people were eating in Honey Girl. But like before the pandemic, I would have eaten there. Yeah. But now I take everything out. Right. Yeah, I know. It's definitely changed. So weird, because it was only like, what, a month and a half that we were locked in our houses, but like, I feel permanently altered. Mm -hmm. This really looks so good. Oh, I'm glad you like it. Yeah. My dad just built this. My mom got an electric fireplace, and then my dad built this wall. And that mantle's from my old condo. It looks so good. Did you get this? Um, Amazon? It's called Modern Blaze. So yeah, you can do it orange or blue or both. Wow, that's cool. Um, and you can make it dimmer. Oh, cool. Or brighter, and then yeah, it has a heater and it has a timer. That's nice. This looks so good. How much was this whole little DIY project? Um, the fireplace was on sale. It was only like 550. It looks so good. Bad. And then um, oh, you see, it's $550? All the oh, wow. Yeah. Wait, well, it gets really warm. Oh, can you feel it? Yeah, I wanted yeah. to see when you turn the Oh, yeah, I just turned the heat this on. This is what I used to do here in the condo all the time. I just put my camera yeah. up here. Yeah, you feel it right there. Feel it blow out. Uh, see, that's Cat low. I like that because it can't lay right in front of it. Yeah, right. And then that's the high one. Yeah, yeah. you don't feel it? Yeah, I can feel yeah. it. That's really hot. Nice. nice. And then where'd you get this wood? Um, yeah, Home Depot. And it was all, I mean, it was just there in stock. I think it was maybe $300 yeah, yeah. for the wood. Wow. No, it was this color. So that's what I say, you didn't even have to paint it? Yeah. Wow. That's like amazing. Yeah. I was originally going to do like darker wood, and Jill was like, absolutely not. It'll be way too dark. Yeah. You have to do something bright. Yeah. Yeah, that's like, okay. great. So it worked out. And your mantle looks nice. Yeah, the mantle looks great. Because was this the one you were trying to give Sarah when yeah. I said it was too big for her? So yeah. it's, it's perfect that yeah, it works. It, yeah. Started Yellowstone. I'm on episode six. You just started at the very beginning? Yeah. He's like, nope, 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 can't do it. I mean, it is so scary, the fire. Oh, what a weird dude. Have you watched the Santa Claus yet this year? No. Let's watch that. 1994. I know. That's so crazy. That's older than you. I know. The original one? Yeah. Can I turn off that TV back there? Oh, sure. I'm getting a... Looks good. Do you put cheese on these? Yeah, it's lemon parmesan broccoli. Yeah. What, could we, what kind of bread is that? I mean, butter is that? Garlic butter. Mmm. That looks good. Mm -hmm. 